Welcome to the first part of the introduction section, which provides an overview of our mobile cloud computing with Android specialization. Every day, millions of people around the world use handheld smartphone and tablet devices that are increasingly based on the Android platform, as shown at this link. These Android devices run software applications that direct users to the places they want to go, securely provide information about the people, locations, goods, and services near them, and help them interact with the people they care about and do business with. These applications increasingly rely on three synergistic computing technologies, collectively known as mobile cloud computing, where applications are designed to run on smart mobile devices, connected to elastic computing services that are accessible over wireless networks. Mobile cloud computing represents the confluence of advances in multi-core and distributed core processors, inexpensive mass storage, ubiquitous wireless connectivity, and commodity hardware platforms. The demand for applications that run on these platforms is growing rapidly, which is motivating the need for software practitioners and researchers who understand how to develop concurrent and network software for mobile devices that connect to powerful cloud platforms. However, despite continuous improvements in hardware and software infrastructure, it remains frustratingly hard to develop high-quality software applications for mobile devices and computing clouds on time and under budget. The impediments to success in this domain arise from various inherent and accidental complexities, ranging from self-inflicted limitations with tedious and error-prone techniques, tools, and methods used to develop software, to fundamental challenges of concurrency and resilience at scale. To help meet the needs and overcome the impediments outlined earlier, I've teamed up with Professor Adam Porter from the University of Maryland and Professor Jules White from Vanderbilt University to create a Coursera specialization that covers many techniques, tools, and methods aimed at alleviating the inherent and accidental complexities of developing mobile cloud computing applications with Android. Specializations are a new form of MOOC aimed at fostering collaborations among teachers and students that span traditional inter- and intra-institution and disciplinary boundaries, as described at this link. The first MOOC in this sequence, the University of Maryland's course, Programming Mobile Applications for Android Handheld Systems, taught by Professor Porter, focused on the design and implementation of user-facing applications, covering the fundamental programming principles, software architecture, and user experience considerations underlying handheld software applications and the Android development environment. The first lecture of week one of Professor Porter's MOOC presents an overview of the Android platform, which you should watch to understand the key components in Android's software architecture. This second MOOC on programming mobile services for Android handheld systems is being taught by me and Professor White from Vanderbilt University. We focus on a range of Android application and middleware programming topics, including threading and concurrency control mechanisms, background service processing, local interprocess communication, and application security. This MOOC builds upon and extends the user-facing applications covered earlier in Professor Porter's MOOC, diving deeper into the guts of Android's powerful middleware platform. For example, we focus on how Android combines advances in hardware and software infrastructure support for concurrency, together with pattern-oriented software architecture and framework techniques to improve the performance, responsiveness, security, and structure of mobile applications so they're more efficient, resilient, and easier to evolve over the software lifecycle. Hi, I'm Jules White, and I'm teaming up with Doug Schmidt to teach the third MOOC in the Mobile Cloud Computing with Android specialization entitled Programming Cloud Services for Android Handheld Systems. This MOOC rounds out our coverage of mobile cloud computing by focusing on how to connect mobile devices to cloud computing and data storage resources, turning a mobile device into an extension of powerful cloud-based services. We'll extend the handheld systems topics covered in the first two MOOCs to focus on architectures for communicating with the cloud using HTTP, server-side processing of mobile data using servlets in the Java Spring framework, and scalable storage of data using NoSQL databases and other platforms. Since building a slow or insecure mobile cloud application is unacceptable, 
This MOOC will not only show you how to program handheld systems that talk to the cloud, but how to do it securely, scalably, and efficiently. This specialization has three MOOCs plus a capstone project. Signature track students who receive a verified certificate with distinction in the three MOOCs can combine what they've learned to build a complete mobile cloud computing application from the ground up. The material covered in our MOOC specialization is based on experience we've gained during the past several decades researching, developing, and applying concurrent and network software written in C++ and Java. The software we've developed has been used by thousands of projects around the world, often for mission-critical systems where the right answer delivered too late becomes the wrong answer. We're delighted to have the opportunity to share the key techniques and practices we've devised and learned over the years to help you become more effective at developing software for mobile devices and clouds. In our experience, the principles, methods, and skills required to develop such software are best learned by attaining mastery of patterns and frameworks. A pattern describes a reusable solution to a common problem that arises within a particular context, which can be as broad as the domain of mobile cloud computing or as narrow as ensuring Android smartphone users are informed when their battery levels are low. A framework is an integrated set of components that collaborate to provide a reusable architecture for a family of related applications or services. Frameworks can also be viewed as concrete realizations of patterns that facilitate direct reuse of detailed designs and source code. We look forward to interacting with you over the next several months to help you learn and apply these patterns and frameworks in your own work on mobile cloud computing with Android, just as we do at Vanderbilt University and the University of Maryland. You'll not only become more productive, but you'll also have a lot more fun and look at the world in new ways.